Before moving on, take a moment to review how functions work. Declare a function named add to numbers. This function should take two arguments and return the sum of those two arguments. Your function should not use hard-coded values and, and an example of that is a hard-coded function here. So let's see, we have a function named say name with a two parameters. First one is the first name and last name. We then returned a value which is a string John Doe. That is our function. These are parameters and we have a value being returned here inside a function say name. Okay, we then invoked or called the say name function. And the first name would be the camper and the last name would be cut. So if we console or we log this function call rather, the result would be John Doe, not the argument camper and cat because this function is a hard coded value. Oh, so as it says here, this function would return John Doe regardless of the, of the arguments passed to the parameters, which are the first name, last name. So John Doe is considered a hard coded value. Okay, supposedly the value would be this too because we have a parameters here. It should this these two values should fill up fill out these two parameters rather, but it would lag this John Doe value because it is a hard coded value. So, anyways, so we have to declare a sum variable and assign it to the value of calling of our add two numbers function. So first ooh, first we have to define a value which would be add to okay add to numbers and then a parenthesis and inside of the parenthesis would be the two argu uh, would be the two parameters as it says here oh this function should take two arguments and return the sum of those two arguments okay Excuse. Alright, so let's do it. First one would be five and then ten. Oh, yep. It should be a parameter actually. So let's say uh, first number, and then the second parameter would be the second number. Then open and close parentheses as inside of this would be uh, functionalities of the function add to numbers okay so we have to what did it say we have to add the five i uh, know we have to add the first number and the second number if the add to numbers has been called so uh, yeah, it should also be lagged. So console.log and then first number and then plus a second number. Don't forget the semicolon. So yeah, that's our function. Now we have to call the function. Add to numbers and then as we remember, we have the parameters first number and the second number. And the first now let our first number be five and the second number be ten. So it will fill out those two parameters and then would be added together and the value would be logged onto the console. So it did not work. What? What did it say? Your function should return the sum. Oh, yes. Uh, 
perhaps it should not be console.log but it should actually be returned because return keyword actually uh, also rather log the volume onto the console and I'm still oh you should declare is some variable oh okay my bad I am very sorry god damn boy so <laughs> so we did um declare uh, define a function actually no and it says here declare is some variable Wait, I just woke up. Wait, let me cook. Uh, damn, I'm sweating over a uh, basic addings, additions. <laughs> anyway, so let's say that's okay, fine. Let's add a variable sum variable and assign it to the value of calling your add to numbers, add to numbers function. So it should not be in here actually it should be here consts and then sum yeah and then there's no functionality in here so it should return the addition of the first number and then the second number okay and then we also have oh we should log yes and lastly we should uh log this variable because it is assigned to the result of adding these two numbers um this work 